Well, are these measures enough to make the Greek fiscal position fundable? Or will we see another downgrade or even worse? Let's ask a rate strategist, as I'm now joined by Nomura International's Charles Diebel. Charles, thank you so much for joining us. Now, in your note, you say that, of course, these measures might not be enough, or you say the situation is concerning. Yeah, I mean, we're in a situation here where you have to differentiate between some of the concerns over default and the dire fiscal situation that Greece is currently in. We see very limited risk of Greece actually defaulting at this point. However, um, the, as we saw from the market reaction this morning, the, the plans that were announced yesterday do tend to concentrate on the revenue side rather than on the spending side. And to keep the ratings agencies happy, that's what we really need to see. We need to see more stringent spending cuts in a similar fashion to that which we've seen from Ireland, some form of austerity budget. If you see that, I think that would remove a lot of the concerns over what the ratings agencies might do from here, and that would allow Greek debt to rally quite strongly. But thus far, we haven't seen that. But, you know, it, it is a sort of ongoing process. So, Charles, you're really saying that at the moment, without a more aggressive plan on spending cuts, it will mean that the ratings agency will take action and Greece won't be able to borrow as much from the ECB? Um, well, I, I don't think that, that, that that's quite the likely scenario. I, I think that unless they take more stringent action on the spending side, there is a chance that the ratings agencies downgrade them. They may wait, wait and see because, as I say, this is a process that's going to take several months. Um, in terms of the, the, EC, the Greek paper being eligible at the ECB, we, we know that the, the, the collateral band is triple B minus until the end of 2010. And frankly, I think it's very unlikely that even if we have seen a downgrade to, say, triple B plus by uh, either S&P or Moody's by that time, that the ECB would then go to an A minus bracket, which is what they used to have prior to the crisis. So, Charles, basically, you also think that we should differentiate between what is worrying but by no means catastrophic fiscal situation and market pricing. Yeah, I mean, I, I think that, uh, that there is there's an awful lot of risk effectively priced into the Greek debt at this point in time. Um, I don't think there will be a, a particular problem in terms of them being able to fund themselves, i.e. by being able to generate, um, you know, decent bond auctions and raise finance. Um, the, the, the real dichotomy at the moment is that there are other European nations that are in an equally bad condition uh, that are not really suffering the same sort of pressure at this point in time. And uh, with that, we're particularly concerned about uh, Portugal and Spain going forward. Uh, Charles, do we need some kind of comprehensive plan in terms of what the EU could offer Greece today? Or would that actually put a very dangerous precedent on other countries such as Portugal and Spain? Um, well, clearly, the, 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 the EU and uh, the, the, some of the other uh, European countries don't want to be seen to be, if you like, forgiving the, the, the situation on a special case. Um, they want to see uh, fiscal austerity. They want to see discipline going forward, and thereby, you know, they, they are without a doubt um, putting a lot of pressure on the Greek authorities to come up with a, a credible plan. Now, what we saw last night is uh, an improvement on what we had before, but at this stage it probably doesn't go far enough, and thereby probably in the short term Greek bonds remain under pressure. Um, it's also the fact, as I said, that I, th I think uh, some of the other European countries uh, in due course could come under an equal amount of pressure. Charles, thank you so much for that. Charles Diebel there from Nomura.